welcome to my channel Thomas Sheep and today I will be showing you how to crochet this beanie with this very nice pattern and it's up to you if you will make a basic beanie or if you will make a slouchy beanie I will show you step by step how to make different sizes so let's get started For this project I have used this amazing yarn, it's called Big Merino from Drops and it's 100% wool, it's 100% merino wool and it's 50 grams and 75 meters. I will be using 4 millimeters crochet hook and 5 millimeters crochet hook. I'm going to use 4 millimeters crochet hook just for the hem of beanie and start with a slip knot and then if you want to follow me and if you want to have the same high of the hem of beanie uh, start with chain nine if you want to have lower uh, hem of beanie make chain seven or eight okay now we are going to make single crochet start in the second chain and make first single crochet then make one single crochet in each chain across Always at the end of each row make chain one and turn and from the second row we are going to use just back loop. So when you turn it like this you can see back loops here. So we will use just this back loop and always start to make first single crochet in very first back loop. So this is the first back loop where you have to make first single crochet then make one single crochet in each this back loop across but we will not use back loop for very last single crochet of each row we will use stitches so in my case when I made chain 9 so I have to make uh, seven single crochets into the back loop and now last eighth single crochet of the row has to go into the stitch because we want to have straight edge nice straight edge at the end of each row how i said chain one and turn and repeat it again so start in very first back loop and make first single crochet so you have to make uh, seven single crochet uh, into the back loop and last single crochet goes into the stitch so you have to make eight single crochets in each row in total okay continue working like this and to make the beanie hem the same long as the circumference of the size of beanie you are making. And for this pattern you need to get an odd number of rows, so odd number of stitches for the main part, for making of the main part of this beanie. So you can pause the video for now and then meet me back again. Okay, this is how it looks like and now we have to join both sides of the hem of beanie together. So, I'm going to use crochet hook and slip stitches. It's up to you. If you want to use yarn needle and sew it together, it's up to you. You can. 
So, uh, on the on this side, closer to you, we will use stitches, and on the other side, we will, we will use just one loop, and we will use slip stitches. So, we will use just this loop. And for the main part, change the size of crochet hook and I will be using 5 mm crochet hook for the main part of my beanie. If you want to change the color of yarn, you can and to make chain one with the new color of yarn. And we will make half double crochets in this in this row in next row. So you have to make one half double crochet in each stitch all the way around. And you can see here are rows. This is row. This is row. And between is the space between rows. So you have to make one half double crochet on the row and one half double crochet. Uh, into the stitch between rows. So, start in the in the first stitch, which is the stitch uh, between rows. So, here is the first half double crochet. Another half double crochet goes to the stitch on the row and then between rows on the row, between rows on the row. So you have to make one half double crochet in each stitch all the way around.
I'm at the end of the round and if you want, you can finish each row with slip stitch and start each row with chains. It's up to you. We will, uh, we will use, we will work, we will make uh, double crochets and front both double crochets. So if you want, you can, but I'm going to work in a round. So yarn over and into the first stitch, make double crochet. So yarn over, insert your hook into the first stitch, grab the yarn, pull it through. Now you have three loops on your hook, grab the yarn, pull it through two loops. And then grab the yarn and pull it through two. This is double crochet. Now make front pulls double crochet. So go under this stitch, under the uh, half double crochet from previous round and finish double crochet. So you will alternate double crochet and front post double crochet all the way around. So now double crochet. Now front post double crochet. And at the end of the round, you will continue in the same pattern. So you should, uh, you should finish with double crochet. And it's easier for me to work in the round. So if you want to finish each round with slip stitch and start every round with chains, you can, it's up to you. So continue working like this until you reach the desired height of your beanie, but we will decrease. Uh, so you should stop to crochet uh, 5 centimeters or 5.5 centimeters earlier. Okay, this is how it looks like. I really like the pattern and my beanie, height of my beanie is now about... 17 or 18 centimeters um, so it's too much uh, you can stop uh, when you have 15 centimeters or 15 and a half uh, or 16 uh, if you are making basic beanie okay and now we are going to decrease
So you can see there is a front post from previous round, so make double crochet. And now you can see you should make front post. So start to make front post, double crochet. Now grab the yarn, pull it through two. Don't finish it. Grab the yarn, skip this stitch and go here and finish front post double crochet. So we make two front post double crochet together. So now pull it through two and now pull it through three. So we have decreased. Now double crochet in next stitch. In the next stitch, front post, double crochet. Next, double crochet. And this is series, what you have to repeat. So now we are going to decrease again. So I have decreased and now I have to make double crochet, front post, double crochet and double crochet and then decrease again. And you will continue working like this all the way around. Okay, I'm nearly at the end of the round and this is first decrease and here is last decrease, but it's not last decrease, you will decrease one more time. Okay, and we have decreased um, last time in this round, so now after decrease round, you will make the same pattern as before decrease round. So you will make always uh, where you decrease. So make a double crochet and then front pose double crochet. So alternate double crochet and front pose double crochet all the way around. And these two rounds you have to repeat two more times. So you will repeat um, decrease round, round without decrease, then decrease round and round without decrease. So these two rounds you have to repeat in total three times. And for an adult size of this beanie, I have used two and a half balls of yarn. And now it's last step. And my beanie has a height 22 centimeters, 21 centimeters, but 20, 20.5 20, uh, is enough, I think. Somebody likes hats longer, so it's up to you. Now take a needle and we have to uh, make a few stitch around and close the hole. So go inside out and outside in all the way around.
and then you can tighten and then you have to make a few more stitches in the same way. Okay, now I want to get to the wrong side and I will make a few more stitches also on the wrong side of your beanie or of my beanie uh, and that's it. So make a few more stitches in the same way also on the wrong side then make a simple knot and that's it. And then you have to weave all tails inside the beanie and it's very very last step step of this pattern so that's all from me if you want you can use a pom-pom it's very nice with pom-pom or you can leave it like this I hope you liked the tutorial, if you do put the thumb up I will be happy for it. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon, bye bye.